So welcome to day six of my antique quilt restoration project. That little panel took me a day <laughs> because it's original uh, artwork from the original artist. I um, had to restore it quite a bit. Um, and this is from my first antique uh, acquisition. And I did do this one. It took, oh gosh, this took about three days. Oh, and I, I'll mention that um, when I bought this 10 years ago, I think I found it for $75 on eBay. Anyway, I called a restoration specialist who quoted me. Uh, he said, well, you can leave it for two months and it'll cost $2,000. And now I know why. Okay. Um, and then this is my most recent acquisition. This is a quilt top, which means it never got finished as a actual quilt that you could use. Um, but it's got all these wonderful fabrics and and these amazing you know stitches that they did back in the day and look at that that's a that's hand painted that's um i think that's velveteen and there are a couple of of uh, patches that have um the artist sand painting on it so i'm really um uh, very fond of this this one um, I estimate I have probably uh, stabilized, replaced, torn out and replaced, patched about 60 of these patches. Um, some of them were the, oh gosh, here's something I'm still working on. I think the, I don't know if it's the warp or the woof. You know, there's a warp and a woof in fabric. I guess that's the woof and maybe the warp is left. Anyway, yeah, <laughs> that's why they call it a crazy quilt. You get warped working on it. Okay, I'm almost done.